Hey everybody, this is Don over at Johnny's Used Cars. In an effort to keep these videos a little bit shorter, please go down to the description box and read the important information there. If you're on your phone, please click the title of the video. That'll take you there to YouTube. Or if you're on our website, click the uh, YouTube icon on the bottom right of the video. That'll take you there as well to see the information for yourself. Uh, today I'm going to show you this 2006 Subaru Legacy B4 Wagon. This is the non-turbo edition. Uh, it's got just over 95,000 kilometers on it, which is about, I don't know, 58,000 miles. Let's take a look around, we'll show you the features inside. This Legacy Wagon is a five passenger vehicle in the 300 series category, which is the larger category. Road tax per year is gonna be 19,000 yen, which is about $175 right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April, May time frame, So we'll take care of it for this year. Just make sure you take care of it in April because everybody loves to wait till the last minute in, in May. So just go ahead and uh, take care of it in April, you'll be fine. You won't have to wait through the long lines. Uh, it does have some aftermarket wheels on that. But there are two ways that you can uh, pay for this. You can pay for the U.S. cash outright with U.S. dollars. Or you go ahead and take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months with zero down. Yes, you heard that right. We don't require a down payment, but if you want to put something down to reduce your overall monthly payments, that'll help. Okay? Totally your choice. Here's the inside. Now, this is just coming in. It, uh, it has not been detailed yet. But I'm just trying to get as many vehicles on the website as possible. We have a very, very high turnaround. So if you're interested in one of our vehicles, please go ahead and stop by and check it check it out, okay? Let me uh, zero that. All right. Okay, 95,551 on the, uh, or 511 on the odometer. Again, it's about uh, 56,000 uh, miles. Uh, I'll show you a couple of warning lights. The two up there, obviously the, the top one is your seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. Uh, the one to the bottom left of that is your emergency brake. It's not a low pressure tire gauge. We get that a lot. But it is a handbrake. So when you disengage, it goes away. Engage it, comes right back on. And then there is an eco mode. And then your low fuel light, okay? On that, just a very uh, simple, straightforward, straight ahead. I don't know why that's not clear. There you go. Uh, instrument cluster, okay? Uh, anything pops up on a dash, please pull over, find out what it is, and then take the necessary action, all right? I'll just lower that fan for a little bit. Uh, off to the left here, you do have your um, Japanese navigation that you'll probably never use. This does have a rear camera. And then you have your radio and air conditioning controls, shifter. And that's that eco mode, so if you uh, push that, that green one goes away. Just depends on if you want to save a little more gas. Here's the handbrake I told you about, and then you have two cup holders. You also have a, a, a little storage compartment under the console with a power outlet. Continuing off to the left, you do have your uh, glove box. A little bit of storage in each door panel. Okay. And then that is your um, passenger space along with your uh, little red road flare in the uh, corner there. Let me make sure this seat is all the way down, all the way back, which it is. Okay, so I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. Um, yeah, I could drive it as is or slide it up a couple inches and still be comfortable uh, without any worries. Okay, so let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. Really can't see anything past the windshield wipers. Looks like it has a little factory tint on the back. The Subaru uh, air conditioners are pretty strong anyway. So, But uh, this is normally the time I show you the auction sheet. However, because it has not been detailed, I keep those inside until they have been detailed. So if you do come out and it's not detailed yet, I can go inside and get it. That's no problem. Uh, or if it's been detailed, it's going to be up here on uh, the driver's side uh, sun visor. Now, we keep the auction sheets not only give you peace of mind knowing that it has not been in any accidents, but also um, it's a good selling tool for you when you get ready to get out of here after a couple of years that if you've had no accident, you can show that to the next potential owner. Okay? Uh, you do have your uh, controls for the mirrors. Please don't forget on the floor here, you got your gas cover release, okay? And then all the way down here, you follow this down. I don't know what this, why this is here, but yeah, take that off. But this is your, ga uh, your gas cover, your, your uh, hood release, okay? So just follow this all the way down. It's kind of like they hide it, okay? So I'm gonna turn this off. We'll go to the uh, back seat. Show you the space back here. All right. It's very difficult to keep these uh, Subarus on a lot. We get rid of a lot of Subarus. Okay, with the seat all the way back, I'm about, about half inch to an inch uh, between my knees and the back of the seat. There's no storage on the back of the seat, but you do have a net storage on the back of the passenger seat. Nothing on the um, on the door panels, but you do have cup holders down here, okay? And then you do have a, a, an armrest as well, okay? 
And I should mention, start mentioning in my videos, these do have the latch system for child seats, okay? That'll be on the uh, le uh, right and uh, left sides, not in the middle. Uh, this is all-wheel drive. And this is your trunk space. Now, the uh, privacy shade you can take out if you have to haul stuff. Um, these seats will fold forward, so all you have to do is push that one, and it goes bye-bye. That, um, that, that seat is kind of pushed back all the way, but it does go flat, okay? So let's uh, check out this engine really quick, and then we'll wrap up this video. Yeah, it's gonna uh, look nice when it's uh, detailed. So you go in the good old boxer engine. All right, 2006 Legacy B4 uh, Sport Wagon. Uh, 90, just over 95,000 kilometers on it, which is again, about 55, 56,000 miles. Uh, military price goes down to 4,900. With the additional military discount, we'll get it down to 47. Please check below to see what that includes and doesn't include. Um, as always, we encourage you to shop around, go out to other dealers, see what they have, and then stop by Johnny's Used Cars. Let us show you what we have here and what our program's all about. We are very different, okay? So, uh, thank you very... Oh, don't forget, as I'm, I'm about to forget, you can pay cash outright uh, for this with US Dollars Cash. Take advantage or take advantage of our 0% finance for 24 months with zero down. Yes, zero down. So, thank you very much for watching. Take care uh, and hope to see you soon.